We start with a block of quartz. The light with one polarization coming into it will experience a refractive index of N1, while light at a perpendicular polarization to this will experience a refractive index N2. The light outside the block will move with a speed C, whereas the light inside a block will move with a speed of C1 or C2, depending on the polarization. All of the light will have a frequency F, and at any point, the speed of the light C is related to the frequency F and the wavelength lambda at that point by C equals F lambda. The speed C is given by C0, the speed of light in a vacuum, divided by N, the refractive index at that point. By combining these for the two different polarizations inside the quartz, you can obtain different wavelengths for each polarization. Let's call the thickness of the quartz T. If we have a wavelength lambda 1, you have to think how many times will that wavelength fit inside the distance T. You should also do the same for lambda 2. This will give you two equations that you can combine by realizing that because we're looking for the minimum thickness of the quartz, the difference between the number of wavelengths must be exactly one half. Now, try to use this to work out T.